This is just kind of a test video and I just want to give some quick tips to some new believers. Um, first of all, I suggest that you stay away from church buildings because there are many unbiblical things that go on there, false doctrines being taught and mostly filled with lost people. So what you need to do is you need to focus on studying the Bible. You need to get yourself a King James Bible and you can contact me if you don't have one. It is written kjv at gmail.com and I'll try to get you one. But you need to focus on reading the Bible from cover to cover and focus on reading it every day and praying daily. Um, and some tips on reading the Bible if you, you know sometimes you don't feel like reading, you know, you're kind of exhausted or whatever, I suggest that you listen You listen to it. You can get on YouTube and there are, there are King James audio Bibles. There are some with music and different voices and, and some without just one guy talking, whatever way you like it. As long as you're getting the word daily, then that's what you need to be doing. Um, you need to focus on going through the Bible from cover to cover so you know what's in it. Um, I suggest that you make marks in your Bible, highlight things. Um, I listened to the Bible through with the audio Bible and I highlighted every time someone's speaking in yellow. Okay, this is all somebody speaking. You know, but I went through and I highlighted different things too when, when someone isn't speaking or when there's prayer I put in pink. You know, so whatever helps you to divide the Bible to to learn then do it and write references write notes in the Bible don't worry about making markings in the Bible underline things you know it can be really helpful to learn things so make marks in your Bible uh, read it every day um, search for sermons you know and and search online for things, but just make sure that you check everything with the King James Bible. Make sure it lines up, because there's a lot of false teaching out there. Uh, you can get on Sermon Audio, and there's a bunch of sermons all over YouTube. Um, I also suggest that you somehow memorize scripture. Um, write it down on a little piece of paper and carry it around with you, and, and read it over and over, you know, whatever it takes. I put scripture on my wall got verses all over my wall so I, I get up in the morning and read them and I try to memorize them and also print out um, or use uh, charts and stuff you know I use a lot of different charts for different things this talks about the King James Bible but you know this is kinda like the timeline for the Old Testament I got uh, you know, you can get maps. I suggest that you get a printer if you can. If you have the internet and a computer, a printer can help out a lot. I got a chart for Revelation. So, you know, charts and graphs and stuff like that, they can be really helpful to learning the Bible, too. And if you get a printer, then you can, you can also print out your own, like, Bible tracts to hand out to people. Uh, you can print out notes and stuff, and it's easier to, to read them that way. And so just read the Bible from cover to cover. Read the Bible daily. Pray daily. Stay away from church buildings. Don't be afraid to mark your Bible. Listen to audio Bibles. Get charts and graphs. Get notes. Listen to sermons. Um, if I would have known some of this stuff sooner, it would have helped me sooner. So I hope that it will help you. And thank you, and God bless. Except ye be converted and become as little children, ye shall not enter into the kingdom of heaven.